A giant iceberg appears to have disrupted the breeding season for penguins near Mawson's huts in Antarctica. Ecologists on the Mawson Territory centenary voyage are seeing firsthand how unseasonally heavy ice has impacted on the local wildlife. It's the same ice which has delayed the commemoration of Sir Douglas Mawson's expedition. The ABC's Karen Barlow reports from Antarctica. The Aurora Australis is parked on this vast expanse of ice 20 kilometres from Commonwealth Bay. It's fast ice which is tied to land and this is as close as a ship will get to Mawson's huts. The local population has come out to greet the expeditioners for the Mawson centenary commemorations. It's nesting season for the Adelie penguin but these ones are out foraging for food. This year's unseasonal fast ice has made life tougher for these fearless birds and it's all due to the presence of that troublesome iceberg to the north. And it's a barrier to Adelie penguins between their breeding sites and their foraging areas. But this year because of the big iceberg B9 there's a fast ice going out to 10 miles from the breeding colonies. So the penguins have to travel a lot further to get to their foraging grounds than they would normally. The ecologists expect the number of penguin chicks for each nest will be lower than it would be for a normal year. They are here on this voyage to find out. We'll be doing some counts when we get there around the penguin colony. So we'll count the number of adults and nests and the number of chicks as well. Uh, but we'll also be putting out some, a camera and that can uh, take photos every day through this season but also other seasons and we can get measures of breeding success there. The wait is on for the best weather window to hold the commemorations of the first ever Australasian Antarctic expedition. It could still be a few days away. Karen Barlow, ABC News, Antarctica.